y'all wasn't even filming. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sage. If you are new here, welcome. So today's video is going to be a little bit different because my hair is out and my hair is straight. So I decided a couple of days ago to go to the Dominicans to get my hair professionally blown out, um, flat ironed and professionally trimmed. I just wanted to really go there for a trim because I typically do my own trims, but I feel like there are areas of my hair that I cannot see. And to have somebody else do that who can visually see my head would be better. And um, so I went there and then I decided on a whim that I wanted to get my hair blown out and flat ironed as well. So I'm going to show you guys my hair growth as a length check um, from being natural. I realized that I had this ponytail hanging around my house that I'm super excited to try on because this is such an extra ponytail you guys so today I'll be doing like a ponytail look this is from sensational it is their instant pony and it says that you can put it on in less than 60 seconds this ponytail is in the style perm yaki 30 inch and I did get this in a color number one and this is a drawstring ponytail what I like about this ponytail is the fact that you can flat iron it or curl it so my hair is naturally, genetically, very thin and very, what's the word I'm looking for, fine. So my hair is not very thick at all. Um, and she did use a lot of product when she flat ironed my hair. So it's like literally weighed down and super, super, super thin <laughs> and greasy looking. And this is reminding me of like 1994 vibes, but that's why I got my, um, ponytail here this is so weird me taking this wrap out because I'm not used to this this is the first time that I wrapped my natural hair it's so weird but yes this is it this is her So she only cut the smallest amount off, but she got my hair super straight. This is reminding me so much of when I was relaxed. Like my, my scalp is super duper straight. My hair is so flat, which I don't miss about being relaxed. Because I wanna do kind of like a 90s look today, I'm gonna have like a part in the middle, then I'm gonna have my little two pieces coming down right here. I'm gonna put my hair in a ponytail at the top or a bun. And then I'm going to put the um, the clip-in ponytail on top of this. Okay, so now that I have the bun going on, I am just going to attach the drawstring ponytail. This is only the second time that I've ever tried drawstring ponytails. So, hoping that this works because my hair definitely needs some type of clip-ins, extensions, something going on right now because it's very, 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 very thin. But when it's in its natural state, you can't tell how fine it is. It looks kind of thick, but I don't have that many strands on my actual head. So from what I can remember from last time trying the drawstring ponytail, it's pretty much like a hat. You would just stretch it, put it over your bun, Put the comb in the front, the comb in the back, and then wrap the drawstring around the actual ponytail, and then secure that with a bobby pin. So that's what I'm about to do. Put it around the bun. Make sure the bun is tucked in underneath. This is kind of hard because it's so much hair. Should have probably gotten help with this. Okay, can't really see what I'm doing. All right, so now I'm just going to grab this drawstring and wrap it around. Pull it tight first. I should have put this in a braid or something so it could be easier. Okay, so now it's on and it's filling tight. I'm grabbing a bobby pin. I have the drawstring thing right here. I'm just gonna secure that 
in. It's secured. It's secured. I'm gonna comb it a little bit. Change my clothes and I'll come right back to show you guys the final look. This ponytail is definitely giving me Madonna 80s vibes. I love it. Yeah, that's right. It's Bezos. Ay, ay, ay.